tutorial 85 in inventor in this tutorial we're going to create some parts to use them in assembly and they will be a good review for the skill we learned before so start new and we're here in the part it's a standard metric create So we're going to create a flywheel. So let's start to the sketch. Select the plane we want. And then the 2 the sketching menu is open. You can select circle. Give it a dimension. From here. Give it 60 millimeter. And then to 3d model menu we extrude it into 10 millimeter okay so we created uh, a disk so now let's create a hole but before creating a hole because we have a cylindrical view we need to create a point where we need the hole so let's create a sketch on that surface by clicking on it, insert or create sketch. Now select the point and then give it a dimension 25. So now we have the place of our hole and then finish the sketch. Go to the hole and here you choose from sketch and you see here the hole is created on the point we made so we make the the hole five millimeter and termination through through all then okay so now we have to repeat this so we use the circular pattern in the pattern menu circular feature we select the feature to be the hole the axis of rotation the earth cylinder and the number we can make six okay so this is the first part now let's save it on computer let's create a bit parts for assembly and now let's choose this is part one the disk now let's create a new part standard create and in this time we're going to make a cylinder to join the disks we can do that also with the primitives cylinder can choose this plane and can simply insert cylinder and give it cancel this activity cylinder give it a dimension so now when you are click type 5 millimeter and then press enter and extrude it to 50 millimeter so this is the connector let's save it part 2 connector So now we created very simple parts to start assembly with them. So in the next tutorial, we're going to start a new assembly and show you how to insert your components.